Biden claims his characterization of Xi as a dictator has no real consequence for U.S.-China relations. President of the United States Joe Biden dismissed worries about his characterization of Chinese President Xi Jinping as a dictator, claiming that his comments did not jeopardize diplomatic efforts to repair shaky relations between the two nations. At a joint news conference with Indian Prime Minister Narendra Modi on Thursday in Washington, Biden told reporters, I don't think it's had any significant consequence. One day after Secretary of State Antony Blinken concluded his first official trip to Beijing, Biden referred to President Xi as a dictator addressing a campaign fundraiser in California on Tuesday. Blinken's trip was aimed at mending ties between the two global powers that hit rock bottom after the U.S. in February shot down what it described as a surveillance balloon off the coast of South Carolina. China denies it was a spy balloon. Within hours of Biden's remarks, China shot back with a sharp response, calling the comment utterly absurd and irresponsible and a provocation. China's ambassador to the U.S., Xie Feng, made serious representations and strong protests to the Biden administration, according to NBC. In a statement Thursday, a spokesperson for the Chinese embassy in the U.S., Liu Pengyu, said China will not accept political provocation against China's top leader, NBC reported. We urge the U.S. side to immediately take earnest actions to undo the negative impact and honor its own commitments. Otherwise, it will have to bear all the consequences, Liu said. CNBC politics The situation underscores the tricky balance Biden must strike in managing ties with an assertive global rival while trying to appeal to domestic voters. I've said this for some time, that the hysteria about their relationship with China is collapsing and moving, etc., etc. We had an incident that caused some, some confusion, you might say, Biden said Thursday. But Secretary Blinken had a great trip to China. I expect to be meeting with President Xi sometime in the future, in the near term.